If you are like so many other Americans, your holiday plans likely include a trip somewhere. Somewhere, but as uh, well as we all know, traveling can be stressful. Our Orca Mano has some tips to lessen the stress of flying. The holiday travel season is upon us, but as you take to the skies, KHOU 11 is answering some big questions. What are the best airlines? Where are the best airports? And how will construction here at Bush Airport impact travelers? Millions will be flying for the Thanksgiving and Christmas holidays, and with so many airline options, which ones can you trust to get you to your destination on time? So it's important to look at both the on-time percentage as well as the overall cancellation rate. NerdWallet travel expert Sally French tells me their research found that the three most reliable airlines are Delta, Alaska, and United. As far as airlines with the highest rate of on-time arrivals, that's actually Delta Airlines. So as you plan your trips, what airlines are less likely to arrive on time? As far as the worst, those typically go to the budget airlines. NerdWallet says that's Frontier, JetBlue, and Southwest. So you've picked an airline. Now, where do you fly to? The larger airports tend to have more issues. Ensure My Trip compiled a list of the airports with the highest percentage of flight delays this year. San Francisco International tops the list at just over 37% of flights delayed. But closer to home... Dallas, San Antonio, Austin, oh, Texas kind of represents quite a bit um, of the top 10, unfortunately. And George Bush Intercontinental Airport ranks number four in Ensure My Trip's list of airports with the highest percentage of 2024 flight cancellations. Speaking of Bush Airport, travelers say the ongoing construction here is continuing to cause traffic headaches, but officials tell me the roadway here in front of Terminal D will be back to four lanes by Thanksgiving. With us being able to open that fourth lane, it's going to give us much more capacity to have people flow through the airport more efficiently. Uh, but again, it is one of those things. It is Thanksgiving. It will be busy. Looking ahead to Christmas, Houston Airport System Director Jim Sesniak says construction will be wrapped up on IEH's brand new international arrivals curb. You got a single lane there. Now we're going to be going to a facility that's going to have eight, uh, eight lanes down there. So it's, again, a big improvement. And the end is in sight. It's a weight off of my shoulders and a weight off the travelers' uh, shoulders, too. Hopefully, you now have some useful information as you book your flights for the holidays. For more stats, head to KHOU.com. Reporting from Bush Airport, Orcomana, KHOU 11 News.